Welcome back to the channel, Crypto Tro. I am Crypto Tro, bringing you the latest and the greatest in cryptocurrencies for beginners. And today, man, we're going to give an update on DeFi Kingdoms, and they're doing a special event for all the players. If you haven't already heard, they are doing a special event. I'm going to announce it during the video, so stay, stay tuned. But this is something major that's going to happen, in my personal opinion, in the DeFi Kingdoms game. And it also gives people an extra chance to receive in-game rewards if they haven't had a chance to do so already. So we're going to get into that today. We're going to talk about DeFi Kingdoms price and just how I feel overall on DeFi Kingdoms. But before we get into that, man, make sure... You subscribe to the YouTube channel, like this video, and subscribe to the page. I got multiple videos showing how to create liquidity pools on Crystalville, how to bridge your jewel to DeFi Kingdom's chain, how to prepare for Crystalville, and just much, much more. So I continuously update my channel with DeFi Kingdom's information. And to stay ahead of that information, hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell as well. So Let's get straight into it, man. I don't want to leave you guys here any longer. And I got to say this, too, before we get into it. I am not a financial advisor whatsoever. I'm just telling my personal opinion and my personal take on specific things in the crypto space. And I'm also just showing you the things that I invest in personally and my thesis on why I invested in it. But before you invest in anything, always make sure you consult with a financial advisor. Make sure you have conviction in the asset that you are about to purchase because you don't want to just buy it without knowing what it truly does, what's the utility, and how is it going to benefit society in the long run. So that's why I would say make sure you got conviction. And if you don't know too much about investing, always consult with the financial advisor before you get into it. So now I know what the spiel. Let's get into it. DeFi candles. So you know I got to go on deck screen and just looking at what's the top things being traded on the Harmony One's blockchain. And we can see right now, man, DFK Gold is actually the number one traded crypto on the Harmony One's blockchain as of right now. You know, price went up about 3% today. And I believe because... Of the actual special event, I believe more people are actually trying to get their hands on some gold to buy, you know, that golden egg and just different reasons as well. But I want to go down to the jewel and wrap one. And we can see, man, just looking at the chart, we know it's been on a downtrend. But what hasn't been on a downtrend? Like we look at Bitcoin chart, Bitcoin is on a downtrend as well. So I never really complain about these trends because right now everything is still Coop with Bitcoin. I don't care what nobody say. If Bitcoin is down, you might have some L1s that kind of do a little run, but they end up literally dropping just because I believe everything is still correlated with Bitcoin. So a lot of people, a lot of market participants, they look at Bitcoin as an overall general view of the crypto space. Not saying other projects can't do well while Bitcoin is doing bad, but usually those projects kind of come crashing hard longer Bitcoin stays in that bear. So we see right now price is at $4.85, down 2% on the day but that's cool man that's really a good good entry point to get in if you haven't already bought some jewel man so that's how i look at it that's a very very good entry point but hey take it how you see it i'm gonna scoop me some more jewel any jewel under five dollars i'm scooping it up because i've been in profit since a dollar man so the best thing in my personal opinion start buying jewel at low prices and getting those high liquidity pools those high aprs now you do got to worry about some of the jewel being locked up but now the unlocking period is happening and you will have more unlocked jewel if you decided to get on serendale and participate through the harmony ones blockchain so something else i want to look at man just to show you DeFi candles is still on top of its thing so we see right now we're looking we see Number one is Axie Infinity with a volume of 11.28 million. But coming in second place is DeFi Kingdoms at 8.45 million. Then we see, look at the users, man. We see Axie has a total of 
21.75k users, while DeFi Kingdoms has 21.97k users, man. So we actually have more users than DeFi Kingdoms. I mean, not then DeFi Kingdoms, then Axie Infinity in the last 24 hours. And then look at the balance. The balance is actually higher as well. We see a balance of 1.53 billion compared to Axie's 1.14 billion. So everything just adding up with DeFi Kingdoms. Like a lot of people panic when it when the price drop, but you just gotta understand everything is in the bear market. And I don't know if you watched my video from yesterday. Um, but I was talking about how it is still tax season. Like this is the last week to actually file your taxes. And you got to understand a lot of people with big money, money markets, uh, and people who move the markets, they actually play or pay their taxes with the profits from specific crypto. So you got to just wait it out, wait till the tax season, wait till the summer comes. That's when we see, you know, all that money flowing back into it. Just watch. I'm telling you, we see what happened last summer you know we see just the summers out right out the tax season we see you know we usually see a, a small bounce back so i'm not worried about any short-term price actually i'm just looking at the analytics and just comparing it to you know what is considered the number one nft play to earn game right now and the beautiful thing about DeFi Kingdoms is the game hasn't even been released yet so I'm looking forward to the game being released and everything coming to fruition. And we just see DeFi Kingdoms just come out and just crush the NFT play to earn sector. So to the good stuff, man, what is the special event that you are talking about, Tro? I need to know so I can know how to prepare myself. Well, DeFi Kingdoms has just announced the Yara special events got Gaia's song. So a celebration and special in-game event that portends a beautiful or bountiful harvest and some exciting news giving players 10x the chances to find eggs. So you can actually have an opportunity to get an egg if you haven't already. So what's an egg, Troy? What's an egg? Well, eggs are pretty much the pets in DeFi Kingdoms and you will be able to pair them with your hero. So that's going to be something major. I know a lot of people have been talking like uh, it's bearish to them in their eyes of uh, being able to 10x the chance to find eggs because they grind it so hard. But just think about it. Of course, the floor price is going to go down because uh, more eggs will be on the market. But just think about it. It's still so many heroes compared to eggs. Now, I don't have the numbers pulled up right in front of me, but I know it's way more heroes than eggs so every hero will have or every pet will have to be paired with a hero so i believe it's still scarcity in the eggs and not only that but if you are or have a lot of heroes then you have a better chance at finding eggs now i do got to say the price you want to maintain that price because if you want to sell it, you want to have or maintain a value in the egg. But I me mean, personally, I believe this is going to bring more people into the game. And it's going to help the jewel price appreciate because now more people will want to buy heroes, which will eventually leading to, you know, doing the quest to get more eggs. So that's my personal take on it. I don't think of it as a bullish thing or bearish thing. I think of it as a, a good opportunity to grow the actual project and just to get more people in on the ground floor and make more people excited to buy heroes right now. So that's my personal take on it. That is the special event is Gaia Sung and you will have the opportunity and the chance, or it gives you a 10 X chance to find eggs, man. So if you haven't been questing, you need to get on your quest and this actually starts tomorrow, April 15th, 7 PM eastern time and it ends on april 18th so i guess it's like a little easter egg hunt type of thing you know i guess but you can't and anyone probably didn't want to say easter but it's a good way to get in if you don't have eggs to get you some eggs man so that's my video for today crypto tro if you haven't already follow me on twitter tro underscore crypto and also like this video and subscribe to the youtube channel Y'all are some real ones. I appreciate everybody for tuning in. I'm out of here.